Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Praise and I'm back with another video. So for this week's video, as you all may or may not know, I was supposed to have a Libra's prom. Because of something that shall not be named, my prom was cancelled. Today, I am recreating my prom at home, but with a twist, I'm recreating my prom from two years ago at home. Today, June the 30th, would have been the day of my prom, which I'm quite happy that it was cancelled. Because say my prom was actually on this day, look at the weather I would have had to deal with. And quite frankly, that's not a vibe. Anywho, for me to recreate it at home, we are going to be going through the following steps together. So the first thing we are doing is my hair. I don't know if I further elaborated on, but I never did my hair or my makeup. I have very talented people in my life. So my friend Lola did my makeup for prom and we're literally the same age, like skills. And my auntie did my hair because she's just talented like that. Yeah, so lucky me. But I'm not as talented in either of those realms. So we are downplaying everything. So first up, we are doing my hair. So from what I remember, I will have the photos here, 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 here. I had a wig and that is the first and last time I've ever had a wig since then, like ever in my life. It was a long straight wig and I'm pretty sure it was like a side parting on one of the sides, but yeah, this is the hair. However, as you can see, my hair is not in cornrows for me to actually put the wig on. So we are going with what people in my year called the party hair. So basically at every motive or at every party, I would wear the ponytail which is like i'd say is a look and i love it so much we're going to put the long one on today as a replacement for the wig in which i had two years ago so we're going to do the hair and hopefully it works so let's do that now i'm using this ponytail i wish i could tell you where it's from i genuinely have no clue and i just previously brushed it out and i'm now going to do the style first things first that i am using is a spray bottle and eco styling gel also this medium to soft hard brush and i'm just going to brush back my hair into like a little bun so that I can pop the ponytail on top of it. Now we are going to get a tiny little brush and do my edges on the front. They do exist, don't worry. Now, this in comparison to my hair from last time, you know what? I quite like this look. I just think it's quite plain. I would definitely consider wearing wigs in the future, you never know. But if I went to prom with a hairstyle like this, obviously my aunt would have done it and it would have been like slick back, like proper slick back. But I don't mind this. You know, you could probably jazz it up a bit with jewelry, but I'm quite happy with this. So that is finally hair completed. Now that my hair is done, we are going on to the next step of makeup. Up, which hopefully I don't mess up too badly because as you know in my history of makeup on this channel is very minimal because quite frankly I can't do it I'm trying to learn not the best nor am I going to act like I'm the best because 
I'm just not. But yeah, let's get on to makeup. Now that we are on to makeup, the look I am going to be going for is the look I did two years ago. The picture is here. Like I said, I can't do makeup. So just know I'm going to genuinely try my best. Like, I'm going to try my best. But I'm pretty sure I don't have the palette or anything that she used. Nor can I do my eyebrows. It's a bit of a shambles really. But I'm going to try my best and that's what counts. If you can see by this photo here, I was really loving my look on prom night. I was really taking the pictures. But anyways, how I see it is that it's brown with a bit of glitter on top and a bit of orange so i think that's not too hard to do and like it can't be that much of a shambles the rest of my face was pretty much the same as how i usually do it i don't think she used i don't know if she used foundation on me i have no clue i really have no clue at all with i'm gonna do what i normally do with my face concealer a little bit of foundation and then my eyebrows and then the only hard part which i'm actually going to struggle with is the eyeshadow but everything else should be fine she didn't use fake lashes but this look banged back then i'm so sorry but i've never looked that good good luck with me recreating it so let's get started primer for primer we are using the mary Kay primer with sun cream anywho let's put it's quite oily maybe that's good for you i wish i had a clue foundation concealer what goes first what goes first what goes first foundation foundation i'm using the revolution conceal and define in the color f15 which i'm pretty sure is quite dark for my skin now honestly let me get some water spritzy spritz and then we're gonna apply this oh. maybe i shouldn't oh do i want to do i want to it won't be proper if i don't do it oh. I don't know, I feel like I look dry with it on. Like, does that make sense? Like, I look sort of dry, like drained out. Make sense? No, it just looks really good. That's what I remember. She did put a lot of highlighter, clearly, because my cheekbones be popping. I kid you not, I'm literally looking at this footage here. And the whole time I thought, something's off with my forehead. Guys, the problem is, if you see, look. If you look there, can you see the difference? Or even look here. I didn't blend it into my forehead. That was the problem, but we're just gonna ignore that. I noticed literally looking back at the footage, I didn't blend it in. But I told you I ain't good, so let's continue. I don't think she used concealer, I'm not going to lie. One of them she did not use. And my face just looks really smooth. I don't know. We'll use a little bit of concealer too. Pro Conceal Mineral Formulation. In the color, I don't know. I have no clue. Do you want? I'm just gonna put a little bit just a tiny bit i'm not gonna put it on my forehead just because i feel like it's gonna bring my forehead a bit forward like a tad bit too much and i don't want that also i'm pretty sure when she did my makeup for prom that was honestly the first time i'd ever properly worn makeup that was a whole two years ago wow good enough for me what goes after this let's do eyebrows so we can get this done i don't do my eyebrows one i want to get them done two marley always tweezes my eyebrows and clearly i haven't seen her in ages so that's not been able to happen and also i just can't seem to get it right as you can see here they were popping they were good so i'm just gonna do what i can like lightly just so that i don't like you know my whole look up Brows there. Mm. Oh, I don't care. Also, she did seem to like properly. Yep, she concealed them. She concealed them. So we're gonna conceal them too. Let's get a tiny brush like this and i'm just gonna get the concealer this mirror try my absolute very best to conceal my eyebrows but did i miss out was it a huge mistake that doesn't look too bad i can't help the fact i like to be alone oh this side is so much better 
Okay, my camera is about to die. I'm going to change battery. By the time I'm back, I would have blended this in for you guys. I'm back and I've blended the eyebrows or at least tried. Let me know what you think down below. Um, Now we are going on to the eyeshadow, which I'm probably going to find the hardest. I know she used some like extravagant palette. That's all I know. But we are going to be trying to recreate the look. It's really orange and really shiny and I just don't have those colours here. Let's start the time lapse now. I'm sitting here. I'm also hoping none of you choose to use this as a makeup tutorial because this is just not it. I've done a brown base and now I just don't have that color. It's like a beige. No, why does it look like that? You know what, after this I'm actually going to invest in some palettes. Not like I have anything else to do but this is the biggest fail ever. Like ever. Why am I using the same brush? I know not to do that. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh my god, this looks like dirt that I walked on in the Desperate time for the desperate measure. I'm going to be using this like little cap of highlighter and it's like glitter, but I'm pretty sure it will look so nice if I just put it on my eyelids instead. So let's try it. <gasps> oh, oh wait. Oh, wow. She's shining. Okay, now we use a brush to blend this in. I hold so many small regrets. Okay, that's what I'm doing because quite clearly it's not working. It's not working. It's not working. But this is the eyeshadow though. I literally have it all over my face. Well done me. Well done. Well done praise. Now I'm just gonna do like all you know the final bits that people do. Lips, mascara and I'll be back. And I'm done with the makeup so if I bring myself closer, put some lipstick on, also put some mascara on, don't know if you can see it, I tried my best. But yeah, this is the finished look. This is obviously what it was supposed to look like and this is what I look like instead. So we're going to accept that, move on. I'm not too fast, I still like somewhat like it and yeah, this is the finished makeup look. <laughs> I'm not gonna elaborate much further on that. Let's move on to that. So one thing I noticed that when it comes to my dress, that was like the biggest shambles of prom because I got my dress the day before prom and I got it the day before because the original dress that I wanted to wear, I don't even know if I can find it, but I will put a picture here. Yeah, the original dress I wanted to wear, I bought like a month before and they told me it would be here and we paid for it and literally the day before prom, they were like, oh, you'll get it. and. It wasn't here, so my mom said we're going out to go buy a dress. I bought this dress, which I will show you now. So this is the dress I wore, and I say it's like a bridesmaid dress. It's got really nice detailing. I say I definitely still like it as much as I liked it two years ago. Would I have chosen another one? Probably not. Obviously, the time was restricted, so we're going to put this on. Hopefully, it still fits because I am not the same as I was two years ago. Then again, GCSE is like, I ain't boy. I right, let's put the dress on and see what it looks like. Three, two, one. Yeah. And we are in the dress. I actually love it. I feel like I belong with Tinkerbell. The dress is on. I'm definitely taller, but you can literally see my feet. I'm also thicker on the hips because boy, but yeah, other than that, like I still love it a lot. I actually do love it. This is the back. And yeah, this is the prom dress of 2018. I'm gonna put on the exact same jewelry that I wore last time and then we're gonna go outside and take the photos. Plot twist, I cannot find the earrings, but I found the bangle and I also found the ring, but I cannot find the earrings, which were, I think the earrings that I wore were these dangly ones, which I actually have no clue where they are. So, pearls hoop, pearls hoop. Do you prefer this side or the pearls? The pearls give it a more delicate, angelic look and then the hoops go like, when the pimp's in the crib, mom, drop it like it's hot, drop it like it's hot. 
Drop it like it's hot. I don't know which side I prefer. Let me ask my brother. I am back and my brothers chose the hoop. So we are putting on the hoops now and then we are done. Okay, done. We are done with the prom look. I've got my dress on, done my makeup, I've done my hair. done with doing my hair makeup putting the final dress on it's time for the photos which my brother is hopefully going to take for me outside so now it's time for photos and so that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed me recreating my prom slash having my prom at home because quite frankly there was no other choice for me so yeah if you guys liked this video make sure to like comment share and subscribe comment down below any videos you'd like to see from me and it's been your girl praise and i will see you next week with another video xoxo that's it girl go 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 shorty it's your birthday we gonna party like it's your birthday we gonna sit